Hi hey guys, Shima here, right back again with the two Skylines. Um, the, the new one and the kind of a, the oldish one. Um, we've done the newer one there, as you can see the red there a few days ago. We've got it cleared up and it's come out pretty well. I don't see any dirt in it, so I'll just make it away without polishing it. Um, Richard from the Donuts in Space wanted to know what colour that was. It's on the, the R34. Richard, it's the DecoArt um, Craft Acrylic Paint. This paint is pretty thick. Um, you'll get it in the range. It's 99p a bottle. I got a load of these bottles here right late last year and only started recently starting using these uh, paints. They're kind of made for canvas painting and so forth. Like that. They're pretty thick, so we will need to thin it down uh, to go through the airbrush. I've used distilled water uh, rather than already tap water because there's chemicals in the tap water sort of thing, hardness. Um, that's the colour now. It's pretty thin down there so well for, for the airbrush. Um, but again, as I say, it's a nice paint to use. I've really only started using these paints uh, rather than the automotive paints and the, the Tamiya's and so forth. Um, but build it up in layers, as you know, not to go on too heavy. I went over a white base coat, um, done it the white primer first, um, f and just to make it more vibrant as it is, in the, as you can see here. Can I make crosses like a colony red? Sometimes the more I look at it, but it's not really. It's 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 a high gloss finish on the the red itself, the berry. And I'm just on the fade of the front there with the black, just to break it all up. The other one is done in Valero's paint shifters, uh, red over gold. And it hasn't come out too bad either. As I said I done that one last year. I just gave it an RK there earlier on, or about two hours ago. So it's come out pretty well as well. Now, I got stuck into the two of these when I came back on for my uh, holiday. I'll be away in the morning, four o'clock in the morning for Spain. So I'll give them well enough time to harden up and so forth uh, over the next week or so by the time I get back. So when I get back, I'll get stuck into the two of them. We've also a few oil builds on the go as well. I've got the NASCAR uh, to get the kit in for that yet. And the uh, Cliffs motorcycle group build. I have to start that as well, and then I have my own build going on with Miguel and Ross, the apocalyptic build, which is ongoing, so we're busy, busy bench. So enough here to keep me going for quite some time. So I have, so in between the two, the, all the builds, I've been tattering away between different kits and getting them out. Right guys, enough rambling, so I want to thank you all for watching. Thanks for all the new subs I got yesterday, much appreciated guys. Um, so... Again, keep modeling guys and enjoy the rest of your week. Speak soon. Bye.